Hello everyone, this is Simon from writtenlegalenglish.com and welcome back to week 24 as we look at another overwritten text, at least in my opinion. This has been an overwritten text and could be communicated in a much, much simpler way. And as you can see next to me, this is particularly relevant because this deals with something really, really important to the citizens of France. And that is to say, the permission to be outdoors during the curfew, during the lockdown of COVID-19. But before we start, I quickly want to remind you about the content I put out every single week. So on Tuesday, I put out a text which I think could be redrafted. On Wednesday, you get a video from my professional English course with subtitles now. And on Friday, you get the my commentary on the video that I put out on Tuesday today. So if you want to see all of my content, make sure that you subscribe on YouTube, follow me on uh, Facebook, or join me on LinkedIn, or support me on Patreon, where, you, where you'll also get access to my online courses, extra questions, extra videos, in-depth content, and a lot, lot more. Okay, back to the text. Okay, so as of the time of filming this video, in France, if you want to go out during curfew hours, which are 8 p.m. at night to 6 a.m. in the morning, you need to have a document which you print off from the internet in, uh, in order to show to the relevant um, law enforcement official who will ask why you out during the period of curfew. And I've taken this text from the uh, English, the official English translation of that document. You can click on the link below to see both the web page in English and this document if you want to see it for yourself. And this is what the text says. I, the undersigned, certify that my reasons to be outdoors match one of the following situations, check the box, authorised by the official measures to tackle the spread of COVID-19 as part of the state of health emergency. Then you've got an asterisk, and I've put here just for your information that here, this is where the list of criteria is in the document. And then underneath, you've got the other asterisk, which is people whose situation matches one of the aforementioned and can therefore be exempt must carry when outdoors written proof to justify that exemption. What I would like you to do is think about the main message. As, as always, a great way to start 2021. Let's go back to the basics. What is the main message or main messages in this text? It's been overwritten, in my opinion. It could be communicated, or they could be, the messages could be communicated in a much, much simpler way. We don't have to have asterisks. We maybe think about organising the text in a slightly different way, but definitely there's a main message which is being hidden by the language. And because it's been hidden in the way that there are just so many words, the wordiness is, in my opinion, completely unnecessary. So for the task for this week is to think about that. How would you write it in a simpler way? If you would like to, leave your suggestions below this video. Otherwise, come back on Friday and see how I would deal with this text. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow for Wednesday's video about improving your professional English writing skills. And I'll see you on Friday as I comment on this text.